Federal accident investigators are headed to the site of a massive natural gas explosion in Junction City, Kentucky. One person was killed and at least five others hurt. And as Meg Oliver tells us, it was seen and heard for miles. It's getting bigger. The gas explosion sent a thunderous fireball 300 feet in the air. It felt like you're standing next to a blowtorch. 53-year-old Jody Coulter lived less than 200 yards from the blast. She suffered burns on both arms as she ran from her burning house. We opened the back door, but it was like a tornado of fire just going around and around, and he said, we're trapped. The explosion killed one person and leveled several homes. As you can see, there is nothing but blackened earth behind me, and 12 hours later, it's still smoking. It took emergency officials several hours to get the fire under control. Authorities said the blast was caused by a rupture in a 30-inch gas pipeline that stretches from Texas to New York City. The pipeline is over 9,000 miles long. Officials say the blaze was so large that it showed up on radar. The Texas Eastern Transmission Pipeline is operated by Enbridge. In a statement, the company said, we have isolated the affected line and are working closely with emergency responders to manage the situation. This is the first time you came back? I thought I, there would be a little something left. Didn't expect it just to be like incinerated. Over the last decade, thousands of serious pipeline incidents across the country have killed nearly 120 people. Nora, it could take days before residents are allowed back in here. Meg Oliver, thank you.